Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Noelle and I do unboxings, mostly lifestyle subscription boxes, but also some stationery, books, beauty, jewelry, travel, home decor, and even a very occasional dash of Disney. So if you enjoy unboxings, I do hope you'll consider subscribing to my channel and hitting the notification bell. That way you'll find out whenever I post new videos, announce giveaways, or go live. As always, if you're already subscribed, thank you so much for being here and welcome back. I really appreciate all of your continued support. Those of you who watch every day, those of you who like and comment here and over on Instagram. All of those things help this channel continue to grow slowly but surely. Today I have one of the few beauty boxes that I open consistently here on the channel and that is The Box by Fashionsta, which I think is an amazing value at just $24.99 per month. That does include the shipping and you always receive a value of well over $100. Now this box has been sent to me for review, but even if it wasn't, this is a box that I would continue to subscribe to because I think it is so awesome how they introduce us to awesome new indie brands, up and coming brands, and they are predominantly vegan and cruelty free. I'll leave a link for you in the description box below so that you can save 10% on their site as well, but definitely check it out. Let's go ahead and get into this box and see what our theme for the month of September was. Uh, so this box I think was a little bit delayed, but it does usually come towards the end of the month, but that is why I'm just posting now here at the beginning of October. So the this is what the uh, nice card says, and this is our theme, which is refresh and refocus, which everybody needs to do that sometimes. And I just kind of love their branding. It's this very like artistic black and white photography. I think it's really cool. And then this is what the back of the card looks like. It tells us about each of the items that are included. It also tells us that our total retail value on this box, you guys, is $131. So that is pretty amazing. It's over $100 over what you would pay for the box itself. So. Um, um, there are six items this time around, which is usual, and they do include the individual prices for those items too. So this time, I'm going to go ahead and open it up. And there's no like real hero item this time. Sometimes there'll be one item that has a higher value like by far, but it looks like the highest valued item in this particular box is $39. So let's go ahead and pull out our first item, which has some very nice packaging and seems very seasonal. It's called Wickedly Divine. So let me see if I can find this on here. This is from LA Splash Cosmetics, which is a brand we've seen in here before. This has a value of $16. It says a buildable high impact liquid liner that provides the color that sparkles can be worn alone or layered. This unique formula dries down quickly, provides long lasting wear and will not smudge. It is cruelty free. Wow, you guys, let me just uh, kind of dust this off because sometimes that black shred gets kind of dusty in here. But look at this. That is stunning. That is not what I sort of expected at all. It almost looks like a crazy nail polish bottle, but it's got this shimmery green eyeliner in there. I feel like I'm going to feel like Tinkerbell. And then it's got a red jewel on the top. I don't know if you guys can see that. Wow. The packaging on that is not what I was expecting at all. I think the color is called Grindelo. Huh. So there must have been variations, I'm guessing, with this. So this just kind of unscrews. I'm trying to see how you would actually apply it. This seems like a very adventurous eyeliner, but I think it's gonna be so fun, especially for the season. So it's just got a very thin brush and it's very sparkly, but because it's kind of this like light minty green, I feel like it won't be like too crazy. It might just look like a really nice way of applying some intense like shadow. So I'm kind of into that. That is a neat, neat item that I have never seen anything quite like that. So let's go ahead and get into the next Next one, which is pretty big. So this says transcend and the brand is below. So it does have a little um, L and then an apostrophe and then EAU. So I'm guessing it's like water in French. So low, so blow. It says it's a nourishing spirulina clay mask. So this is the item that they were doing as spoilers over on Instagram. I think there were several variations for these masks. This has a value of $39. It says to learn more about your incredible variant, please visit Blow Beauty beauty.com clay masks for your essential needs allowing you to experience a spa like treatment in the comfort of your own home this is a vegan and cruelty free product so um let me know in the comments below if you got this box and what you got spirulina is so good for you so 
I'll just read about it here. It says, enriched, pure, and natural Canadian glacial oceanic clay with spirulina extract. Reveal hydrated and supple skin with our nourishing spirulina clay mask. This unique blend moisturizes dehydrated skin, revealing a healthy, vibrant complexion. I could definitely use that. My skin gets a little dry, especially in the cooler months of the year. So it says, for the glacial... Uh, oceanic clay it detoxifies for a brighter complexion rehydrates for smooth and supple skin reduces sebum to naturally remove dead skin cells tightens pores to minimize their appearance and promotes a blood circulation and regeneration of damaged skin and the reason you would use the spirulina extract or what that adds to the potion is that it's packed with a wide range of micronutrients consistency consisting of minerals and vitamins a c and e natural anti-inflammatory properties help achieve a more nourished and vibrant complexion so i'm super excited they had some really fun photos over there on instagram too of them with these big swaths of these kind of cool looking clay masks so this is hefty you guys there's definitely some density in there so this is what it looks like there is like a little applicator spoon in the box as well which is kind of cool so i'm wondering if there's probably a seal but wow this is a nice jar so it is sealed of course which i'm but i'll probably open it up when i do take some photos over on instagram but i think love that this is like a clay mask that's kind of pre-mixed it's not um one that is a powder form where you have to mix it because I feel like I can never quite get the right consistency and I'm a little bit la too lazy to do that so I'm excited to give this a try and I bet it's kind of like this kind of color as well because spirulina so I think that is a super cool item we all need a little bit more in terms of masks it kind of goes with the like Halloween seasonal theme too right wearing a uh, kind of mask so I'm loving it and so far I've got like a green theme going as well so let's see what we have got here. This says the Oh Wow Brush. Wow, that's kind of cool. <laughs> it made me say wow. So this is really neat. So we got a little tool as well. So this says, this has a value of $32. So this is the second highest valued item in the box. It says get a beautiful seamless airbrush effect with an immaculate streak-free touch featuring a dome angular shaped surface that is crafted to blend foundation, powder, cream, moisturizer, and primers. And they are a cruelty-free brand. So this is kind of cool like that angle so it's kind of like a beauty blender but actually on a handle so you can really um have a little bit more control over it i feel like so that is neat so it came in this like kind of velvety tray i'm trying to see what it looks like so wow this is quite the tool i'm not sure what this little like section is here for i'm guessing it's just to like get a better grip on it and then it's almost got like a like a little um almost like a toothbrush cover so you could take this traveling which is kind of cool you guys wow that is so velvety looking that is amazing now I don't use a lot of foundation or concealer but uh, maybe I will with this I feel like you're not gonna waste too much of the product when you put it on that just looks like it would feel soft and lovely so what a cool idea and I love that it has that teardrop shape so you can really get into corners and stuff so your girl might have to uh, try using a little bit more in terms of uh, foundation and stuff and then of course during the uh, season where it gets a little bit uh, a little bit cooler and I'm not out in the Sun as much sometimes I do need to have a little bit added color even though I kind of have a, like a natural blush um, I probably needs to start using like bronzer so that I'm not tempted to go out in the Sun quite as much I think that might be my favorite item just because it's so gosh darn unique so let's see what else it is this is shaping up to be a fantastic box this is by kiss and smink that's a cute name. So let's see. It says uh, Kiss and Smink the Everything. And it says a value of $20. A multi-purpose cream stick that can be used on cheeks, lips, lids, or anywhere really. Can be easily applied with fingers. Bye-bye brushes. Hello effortless color. It's kind of funny that they gave us a really fancy brush. And then they gave us this product that you don't need a uh, uh, color a brush for so this is what this looks like it says it's vegan and cruelty free and now I think there were some color variations I look to have gotten the color split which looks like a kind of bright berry but um, more like a fuchsia so that's kind of cool so it says um, you can use it anywhere so I'm guessing it probably doesn't have too much pigment if you can use it on your cheeks etc but I'm trying to open this up and hopefully I'm not gonna um, smash it into the top so wow this is like a fun like candy color so I didn't know if I had to unscrew it but I I figured like it might spin up like a chapstick or a lipstick so I didn't want to smash it into the top but I managed not to but look at that color you guys it's kind of got like a pearly uh, effect to it I wonder if you can see that when you put it on a like slight bit of shimmer so I don't know if that I would use that on my lips but maybe I don't know I guess I could use it on my lids sometimes because I like to do sort of warmer tones um, it actually kind of it might be a nice lip color so I'll have to play it around with that but you guys know me I love to take my product photos over on Instagram 
Instagram, so I like things to be kind of pristine. That's why I don't do a lot of swatches here on my videos, but I will do them sometimes for the photos over on Instagram. So that's kind of a kind of neat uh, lip blush everything kind of thing to have. And that's great for when you are uh, using a very small purse and you don't have room to put all your like touch up materials in there. We got something from Estate, which is a brand that I'm pretty familiar with just from different subscription boxes, probably even this one. Uh, so let's see what it says about this Estate makeup. It says just a taste palette and it says a value of $14. I think there were some variations in this one too. Yeah, so three color variants this month and I could see people's like comments in their Facebook group as well as on their Instagram who were like, oh, I hope I get this one. Oh, I hope I get that one. I hope that one day they are able to do customization, but you guys know customization is a whole can of worms for any subscription box. It just uh, adds a lot of difficulty and complexity. So I totally understand why they don't. And honestly, sometimes it is kind of fun to have a little surprise, you know, and just with as with anything in any subscription box, if it's not quite you, you can definitely pass it on to someone else. So here is the little palette on the inside. Let's see what we've got. Uh, so I got Peach Punch. I forget. I think one had like some cooler colors in it, but this is really pretty. I actually have a very similar palette, um, but the like color didn't have a lot of intensity so I might give this one a try and use it as a replacement of course I love that lavender just to make things a little bit more interesting these sort of peachy tones this kind of champagne color um, very usable daytime colors again I feel like this along with that um, lip or the uh, the everything by kiss and smink I think that absolutely could be a great little like travel set to uh, make sure that you have a little bit of color on your cheeks and your lips and your eyes so pretty cute. Uh, let's see what it says. A super easy blend, easy to blend quad palette to create seamless looks with long lasting color. It is free of mineral oil and parabens and they are again vegan and cruelty free. This does have a value of $14. I think I may have mentioned that already. So I think that is it. I'm just trying to put my little um my little plastic protector back in there. It doesn't want to doesn't want to go inside. There we go. All right, so let's just go over everything that, oh, we got one more thing. I like missed it. I was just so excited with all of those things. So this is from Sistine. It says the Cherub Eye Mask. This has a value of $10. Um, so this looks to be those things that I love, which is the little under eye masks, which I just feel like they make me feel a little more awake. Um, I don't necessarily always notice a huge difference in the skin under my eyes, but I feel like it's good to uh, give the eyes a little extra love and moisturizing. So it's uh, just kind of in this shrink wrapped package not like the most exciting thing to look at but this is what it looks like it says retinol and collagen along with a natural blend of ingredients hydrating and improving the under eye area alleviating fatigue puffiness dark circles crow's feet and wrinkles I will take all of that so it says this is also vegan and cruelty free so let's just go over all of the items that we got in this box and you guys can tell me what variations you got in the comments below and or what your favorite item was in this particular I thought pretty good box pretty varied and also like great value as always so we got our Bleu Beauty um, clay mask, so Bleu Beauté maybe. Um, so this is what that looked like again with the little applicator wand. I'll show you guys over on Instagram. You can see that like creamy smoothness. I'm pretty excited to give that a try honestly. We got our Cherub Eye Mask from Sistine. We got our Kiss and Smink the Everything All Purpose uh, Cream Stick and I got it in this pretty color uh, which is called Split. We got our Estate Makeup Just a Taste palette and mine was again in that uh, peach variation and then we also got our Kaylin makeup oh wow brush which did actually make me say oh wow because I think it is so cool it feels good in your hand honestly I'm super excited to try that out I just have to get some foundation to do it and then we also got our wickedly divine eyeliner from LA splash which is just so cool I was like I haven't ever had I've had color eyeliner like fun like darker colors usually like a purple or a blue but I've never had a sparkly green so that will definitely be kind of going for uh, my fall uh, Halloween looks I think I hope you enjoyed this video if you did please do give it a thumbs up it definitely helps me out like I was saying and I will see you all very very soon in my next unboxing